seltzer, sparkling mineral water, club soda. What's what? What are they? What? Uh, what's good? What's bad? <laughs> are they as healthy as we really think? Am I about to cry? That's the bottom line. Probably here. so, because uh, our registered dietitian, Lisa Gretzelonic, with yourhealthylife.com, always makes us cry. And she's going to tell us what this fizz biz is all about. So, mm. what's up with the fizz? Lots of questions. Yes. Rob just like laid into them all. So, uh, we got to get going, man. Lots concerned. of questions. Because this has actually helped to break my soda addiction. Yes, yeah. and it can be a very good thing. And okay. I want to support that. Okay. So, I just want to kind of let's talk fact from fiction Facts here. And, and let's start with. Good old H2O water. water. And okay. so on the far right here, we have a couple of waters. So I brought a couple of varieties there. Your smart water, this what Essentia. This I'm not quite sure how they Essentia. say their name. But what we have here are waters that have electrolytes added to them. And electrolytes can be a good thing. Electrolytes could be things like your um, magnesium, your calcium. A lot of these bottles will say they add electrolytes for taste because that gives it a more crisper, um, refreshing As taste. I was saying, okay. Propel water is one of the ones that I like, but then I got scared because of you, and it said, because it said that sodium is in it, but yeah. it tastes smooth. Right, and sodium it's is one of the soft. things they'll add, they'll add a touch of yeah. sodium, and it. it's usually not too much to get worried about. So this one here has no sodium in it. Some of them might have like 30 milligrams of mm -hmm. sodium. Mm -hmm. Not a huge deal. So those would be water with just some added electrolytes. No, water is no, good. Yep, and they actually show right. it can be helpful, those electrolytes, which gets okay. us to mineral okay. water. And what ah. mineral water is, is generally it's mineral water that is um, sourced at where the water comes from. So whether it's coming from the mountain, it's coming from okay. the Alps, wherever it's coming from, a lot of them are imported, and it's simply water with minerals. Again, these minerals have been shown to be good for bones, teeth, not a bad thing. Huh. Then okay. we move into sparkling mineral water. And what is that? When you hear the word sparkling, right. you think bubbles. There's right. some carbonation there. Right. So all sparkling water is, is the mineral water that had carbonation added to it, okay? okay? Yeah, okay. So things like LaCroix or the sparkling water. Now the only crux, now these, now by the way, all of these beverages are, at, are as as hydrating as water. So we'll oh, say, well, is this good for me? Is as hydrating like water? Yes. Even the flavored ones? Even the flavored ones. So oh, they're okay. as hydrating as water. The only but, I'm going to say, all with right. the sparkling or carbonated beverages, which are the rest of them on the table okay. here, are when you carbonate a beverage, you bring the acidity up. You make it a little more acid. Oh, okay. And if you add citric acid, which a lot of these add for the flavor, citric acid is an acid, it makes it more acidy. What does that mean in English? It can be bad for your teeth if you're overdoing oh, acidic okay. beverages. Oh, okay. So that's why soda gets a bad rap because of the acidity of it. Okay. It can be bad for your teeth. So still, these, there's no sweetener in any of these. No sweetener in any of these. These are okay. water okay. with flavors. Herbs. Yep. And so, still way better than soda. Still much better option. Just okay. slightly more Phew. acidic. Now, then we have the things where we start getting kind of dicey here, right? Mm -hmm. Where, for example, this is a carbonated water. It's a sparkling water, but it also has artificial sweeteners and artificial coloring. Doesn't color. have any calories in it. Doesn't have any calories, but I'll leave it up to you to decide if you want artificial ingredients. Day in and day right. out in your body. The so, sweeteners and okay? stuff like that. And then this one is actually more like a soda. It's a sparkling on it. It's carbonated. Sparkling just means carbonation. There's right. bubbles. bubbles. But there's sugar in this one, sugar in this one as well. Okay, so they're not like drinking water. This is equivalent to drinking soda, these two. Okay. Which okay? is sugar and, in our body. And let me say, if you just must have something sweet, would you prefer the real stuff versus the synthetic? I would prefer you would go the next option, oh, okay. which would be getting a seltzer or a club soda. Look what it, all seltzer is, is carbonated water. That's all it is. Oh, the only okay. ingredient is water with bubbles in it. And uh, club soda is the same thing, water with bubbles, but they add the minerals for the taste a little, you know, a crisper taste. Sure. Okay. You could get some of these non-caloric add-ins where oh, you get the little yeah. water the droppers, lemon and little stuff. little droppers, really? and put that in here. Now you have all the bubble and the carbonation you want from a soda. No calories, nothing fake, and a better option. But these are sweet. These Ish. these are sweet. These no. are not sweetened at all. There's no sugar, no right. calories. But in you these. could control it, unlike that, where it's like here's. And your here it thing. is. You could add in your flavor and you dial up your sweetness with your drop like of those Plus, sweeteners. And we've used these a long time at our house, and they're great. They're just dehydrated, whatever. Yeah. Lemon, lemon. There's raspberry. And, you know, and this is something that I, is tonic water. Tonic water. To so tonic water is car. It's yeah. very similar to club soda. It's carbonated water with the minerals. However, it's also sugar added. 
So the tonic water <laughs> is not, tree. don't look it's at tonic really water sweet, like though. water. Yeah, it has a bitter taste because of quinine in there. Oh, but um, it's so, so that's why gin and tonics are kind of bittery from mm -hmm. tonic. But tonic water confuses people all the time because they say, well, I'm drinking a tonic water. They think water, but it's a sugar water. This is very equivalent to the sugar in a soda, it ounce per ounce. So the only so we're going water here. is right. the seltzer We're going water. here, right. we're going here, we're going here. This you know? can settle your stomach, though, because of the quinine. Is. It can, and that's where it came around many years ago, is it was kind of a home remedy to help settle oh, the tummy. Tonic. Yes, and, mm -hmm. and the tonic with, in it. And with gin, of course. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that That'll makes everyone feel better. Yeah, wow. <laughs> Always great information. Thank you so You're much, Lisa. Welcome. We'll be right back. <laughs>